Welcome to its traffic. In this video, I am going to do some programs using functions. Our first program program is we have to check a number whether it is odd or even by using function. So first we will input uh, declare a function. I am keeping my function name as void because it will return nothing. That's why I am keeping the return type as void. Void then the function name is odd even then bracket open and off and within the bracket i will pass one integer variable now i will come to the main function here i will declare a variable as n and i will take it input from the user so printf statement printf statement here i will write enter a number then slash n now we will read the number by using scanf here as we are accepting integer variable that's why percent d and we are going to store it in variable n so m percent n now we'll go to next line and we'll call the function odd even so directly we'll write the function name odd even then bracket on and off and inside the bracket will pass the value and uh, variable n then semicolon now it's return zero so our main program finish now we will come out from the main function and we are going to declare the uh, we, we are going to write the definition of odd even function so we will write here void odd even odd even and within uh, brackets we will pass a variable integer variable so i will write int and any name we can keep here suppose a now inside this uh, function we are going to write the logic to find a number if it is odd or even so we are going to write if uh, a as I am passing variable as a, integer as a, that's why a, though our in main function variable name is n, but in the function I am passing it as a, that's why it is a. a, we will write modulus 2 double equal 0. If we divide the a by 2 and get the answer as 0, then we will declare it as even number. So we are going to write printf we can write here like percent d is even and in place of percent d we will display a and now we'll come out from this bracket else part we are going to write else if there is remainder then we will write one more printf statement here we will write percent d is odd if there is a reminder then definitely the number is odd that's why percentage percentage d is odd and the variable is a now we will our function declaration is finished so the last part from the void till bracket closing this is the function declaration and as uh, there is just one statement inside if and else we can write without bracket also but for that we have to maintain the spaces now let's check the output first we'll click on run there is one mistake i think i have forgot semicolon somewhere here on the function declaration always we have to give semicolon don't forget it now let's run it enter a number let's enter it is a uh, 54 so it is coming 54 is even now let's enter some another number odd number so i am writing it as uh, 73 it's coming 73 is odd so my program is working perfectly this way by using function you can check whether a number is odd or even 
you can check first our header file then the function declaration and here the main function in main function just i'm taking one variable as an input and after that i'm calling the function by passing variable passing that variable and in function declaration i am just dividing the number by two and displaying two statement odd and even so that much only we have to do i hope you have understood now let's uh, do it if we have to check if the number is positive or negative then what we will do then what happened just uh, we will change the function name here suppose i am giving check number my function name is check number check underscore number now same i am passing a value and here my condition will be if a greater than zero if it is greater than zero definitely it will be positive so we will write is positive now the next condition else if here we will write if a less than zero then if less than zero definitely it will be negative so we will write a is negative now what happened if a is neither greater nor smaller than zero then it's zero only so we'll write else In, inside the printf statement we will write printf you entered zero so that's our program let's run it again there is some error let's find out what is the error our function name because i have given the function name is check number check underscore number and here also while i am writing the definition there also the function name will be check number now let's run the program so asking me to enter a number let's enter zero it's showing you entered zero now enter a positive number i am entering 45 45 is positive now i will enter a negative number i am entering minus 5 it's coming as minus 5 is negative so that's how you can check a number is positive or negative by using function i hope you have understood thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye